Developing this morning in Pinellas County, the FBI and Secret Service now joining the investigation into an attempt to poison the city of Oldsmar's drinking water system. ABC Action News reporter Vanessa Ariza has more on who stopped it and the danger it could have caused. It is important to note that city officials say the water is safe to drink for residents there. Now it is thanks to an operator and their very close eye and attention that caught this and quite frankly could have turned this into a completely different story. Pinellas County Sheriff Bob Gualtieri says the city notified them Friday that a computer had been remotely accessed. It's reported the water system was accessed twice. The first time was at 8 o'clock in the morning. Officials say it was short and there was no cause for concern. Five and a half hours later, it was accessed again. This time, an operator noticed someone was remotely opening different functions in a system that controls the sodium hydroxide in the water. The person behind the controls raised the levels in the water from 100 ppm to more than 11,000. This is obviously a significant and potentially dangerous increase. Uh, sodium hydroxide, also known as lye, is the main ingredient in liquid drain cleaners. The operator immediately reduced the levels back to normal. Now, as this investigation continues, the water system's protocols are now being reviewed. Sheriff Gualtieri has contacted other municipalities with critical infrastructure and has advised them to take a look at their protocols as well. And it is also important to note that even if that operator hadn't noticed that second access attempt, there are other systems in place that would have stopped it. In Tampa, Vanessa Ariza, ABC Action News. Thank you so much, Vanessa. We first let you know about this in a push alert sent right to your phone. By the way, if you haven't downloaded our free ABC Action News mobile app, make sure you do to get updates on the investigation.